everyone, Mango7 Roll here. How are we doing today? Welcome to another episode of Crossing Void, and I'm really excited for this one because our girl Kimono Asana is finally here. We've been waiting for her for a little bit. Uh, for those of you who don't know, we are getting Kimono Asana now, and then we're getting Kimono Shanna, I believe, when this ends. So on the 21st of January, both limited units. Both uh, very good. From what I gather, Asuna is a better unit, but don't take my word for it. That's just what I have personally uh, read and and been told. So that's kind of what I'm going by. Not to mention, I do like Asuna more, and I think her design is insane. And I actually think I have um, an anime figure of, Kim of Kimono Asuna, so I think it even makes more sense for me. Uh, she's a main unit. My current team right now, in case you haven't seen it in a little bit, is a uh, character here. I always click the wrong button still. Uh, this is my current main team right now, and I plan to replace Kuriyuki Hime, uh, the regular Kuriyuki Hime at the right, uh, for Kimono Asuna. I'm not sure what to do with my supports. Uh, I'm really hoping to summon an A-rank Leafa. That would be awesome. At least an A-rank Leafa. And I'm not really sure what else at this point. But I'm excited nonetheless, and I'm uh, pretty hyped to bring these summons to you. Also, as a shout out, Mangoville is looking for people in their guild, in our guild. Uh, we have the guild battle stuff going pretty well. Um, we cleared this out last week, and we got a ton of rewards for it. So if you're looking for a guild to join, join up on Mangoville. We've got five spots available right now. It is a casual guild, so... Um, we're, we're having fun, we're playing together, but there's no strict requirements or anything like that. Uh, also, I'm sick, so RIP there. So let's get summoning uh, here. We've got a ton of tickets. Um, we've got a ton of stuff. We're, we're ready to go. I click all the wrong buttons. Um, so my plan for Kimono Girl Asuna is number one, try to get her at S rank, obviously. If I don't get her at S rank first, if I get her at a rank i plan to talent shuffle my way and try to get her at s rank and if she does randomly promote which is a really small chance but if she does uh from that point on i will do my best to summon another one just to get the awakening also shout out to jay one of our guild members got her in four pulls the lowest i've ever got a character in this game is 90 i think so would be nice for four pulls so we're gonna take it easy one thing I learned is um, as long as you're willing to spend a little more time, it's actually better just to go one by one because if you do a 10 pull and you get Asuna in the first one, it's still going to do the 9 after. God, I thought that was her right off the bat. That was insane. Um, there's not many things I don't have like this that pop up, so wow. Uh, so we're just going to go one at a time. It's going to take a little bit. I'm sorry for that, but um, honestly, I can watch this animation forever. Let's do two at a time. <laughs> uh, we do get the guaranteed there's one Asuna. Um, not the one we wanted, but I'll take it. Uh, but getting any Asanas is good because you can transmit them for their fragment. And that'll help you talent shuffle. Money bags! God, anytime I get a... Uh, anytime I get... Oh my god, come on, come on, come on! Is that a, that's a guaranteed S, right? Come on, Asuna. Oh my god. Oh. That feels good. Wow, that feels so good. So, so very good. I don't know what to do at this point now. Um, did not expect this. Uh, my luck has been so bad in this game that uh, every single banner I've summoned, I've hit pity. This is the first time I have not hit pity, and to hit it within 10? Oh my lord. That is insane. I can't even believe it. Seven draws. Hog. Um, so we've got our claimable progress rewards here for our raising project. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to buy this this time. I'm kind of running out of the good things to buy with Maigo. I've spent a bit of money in this game. Um, I do like supporting it, so I might buy this one here, $25.99, just to be able to get that, because like this game has been so casual and fun. I, I like supporting it that way. Um, 
And what do you get from this? Can you see the secret plan? Uh, I, I just want to see what the, the skin looks like, basically. Uh, what the skin looks like. Or the hue, I'm sorry. Um, I don't mind it, but I feel like there's better. And then we get, of course, that at the end. Uh, so let's go take a look at our Asuna. I can't believe that. That's so insane. So insane. What do her hues look like? Oh, she's beautiful. Do I want to awaken her? Because I can go in for more and try to get some awakens. I've never done that in this game. But I feel like it's something I might have to do. Uh, and again, the just as a uh, notice, but the game looks much better on my phone. I have my settings a little lower right now on uh, Bluestacks, so the game looks way better there. Oof. Some of these are pretty juicy looking. And this one is the uh, special one through the Raising Project. Honestly, I think... God, I wish this was a different color hair. Because this outfit is perfect. Um, but I honestly, I think I like this one anyway. So I, I think we're going to try to go with this one. But this is Awaken. So we're not going to be able to get that one either. Oh lordy. This is going to be tough. This is a tough choice. I'm going to have to think about this one. Um, wow. I don't know what else to say. I, I guess we're going to stop here because that was insane. I'm going to think about what I've done and think about whether or not I should go for more. And then we might do uh, a part two or something like that. So thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe as always. If you want to play Crossing Void, get it in the link description below as always. Uh, have a wonderful day. Thank you. Bye, everybody.